What is up? In this video, I'm going to show you how to rip a DVD to your Windows 7 computer using WinX DVD Ripper Platinum. This is my favorite program to rip and copy DVDs to my computer, and you can download it by visiting the link in the description below. And uh, once you download it to your computer, you can run the installer file. So just double click on it, click run. Yes. We're going to install it. Just hit next. I accept next, next and install it on your computer. Just hit next. Okay. Next install and it will install on your computer. And when you click finish, the program should open up or you can open it up from your desktop over here by clicking on it. All right, now once you have WinX DVD Ripper Platinum open, the next thing you're gonna do is insert the DVD movie disc into your DVD drive on your Windows 7 computer. Once it's loaded in there, you'll just click this disc button on the top left of the program. It'll pull up this window right here, the source DVD disc. You just choose your movie here. Most likely it'll already be in there by default. It, click OK. It'll load the DVD into the program. And then you'll see this output profile window here. And this is what you want the video format to be uh, copied in. Most likely you're gonna be using uh, PC General Video and just use the recommended MP4 video. That's, that's the best recommendation. But one of the best features about this program is the different profiles that it offers when you're copying the DVD. So if you, if you know you're gonna put it on a device later, you can choose that, that particular device. So if you have iPhone, you can go down iPhone and just choose your recommended option for that. Uh, same thing with Android tablet, Android smartphone. But if you just want to rip it to your computer and leave it there, PC General Video and the MP4 recommended option is what you wanna do. So once you choose your output profile format, just click OK. And here, it'll show you the DVD right here and show you all the titles. Title one is automatically selected. That's the main movie file. So if you wanna just copy the main movie file uh, that's already selected there for you, and if you wanna copy any of the other chapters or extras, you can select these as well. And down here at the bottom, this is just shows you where the DVD will be ripped or copied to when it's copied to your computer. This is the folder. You can go in here and change. If you click browse, you can change the folder. Mine's gonna end up on my desktop, which is okay with me. And now you are ready to rip the DVD to your computer. So just hit that run button in the bottom right. Now, if you're using the free trial version, it'll only copy the first five minutes just to show you it works. Uh, to copy the full movie and to copy unlimited DVDs, you can purchase a registration code for the software. And you can get a special discount on the software if you click that register button from the program itself. All right, so when the copy is complete, it should bring up the folder that it copied the DVD into. And there is my video file right there. So that is how to rip any DVD on a Windows 7 computer. So I hope this helped you out. Again, the link is in the description below. You'll definitely love this program. If you have any questions, just leave a comment and I'll get back to you. Thank you so much for watching. Keep having fun out there and I will talk to you later.